We're happy to say that Martha Stewart's back again this morning with more ways to celebrate the 4th. And this morning, she's throwing a red, white, and block party right here on our plaza. The ideas come from the pages of Martha Stewart Living. Martha, good morning. Nice good morning. to see you. We We've got some, some guests. Yeah, from What's Mississippi. Your name? Terry Ferguson. Nisha Ferguson. All right. They're here visiting us in the plaza, and they're going to help us man this lemonade stand. you got to right. have lemonade at a block party. Oh, yes. And if you sell the lemonade for a good cause, Hold on. you'll make more money. So give a lot of money over here. I only have 50 cents. 50 cents. Oh, Sorry. Matt. Does that get me a glass of lemonade? It, it does indeed. What have you done to make the lemonade special? Well, this is fresh lemonade. So use real lemons and uh, icy water and a little bit of sugar. Uh, you can then decorate them with cherries or lemon slices or a little bit of ginger muddled in the bottom of the glass. Thank you so You can so make it much. a little bit more sophisticated, but I think it tastes really good, don't you think? It's delicious. Mm. Very nice. All right, ladies, good luck with that. Thank you. Raise Talk a lot of money. Talk to me about the banners and everything and the decorations. Well, well, it's so easy to decorate. This is inexpensive burlap that you can cut up and just string with staples on some, uh, some uh, rope. You can blow up some balloons. You can use ladders like this. Um, you can have, oh, the, the toss game. That's so much fun, the beanbag toss. Uh, balloons, umbrellas. Make it comfortable. Uh, invite the whole block and try to coordinate the food. This is a this is a potluck kind oh, of. By the way, thing. I love this. I know we're jumping oh, yeah. ahead of dessert, but I love those oh, yeah. individual you can have cherry one of those. pies. You love this salad for a block party. By the way, is this a, a kind of pot like every pot it's luck pot everybody luck. brings yeah. something? Yeah, I think it's I think it's best to share on a on a big block party like this. But make sure that you kind of have a little bit of a meeting with all your neighbors. Uh, no uncooked food. Because right. it should be cooked, it should be assembled already when you bring it. Bring enough for the whole block. Got to have the conversation yeah. about food right. allergies for certain oh, people yeah. as well. So, so Talk this to me is about a three-bean salad. salad, which is always a favorite at picnics. Uh, olive oil, vinegar, Dijon mustard, salt and pepper, and the beans can be the yellow string beans, uh, fresh green beans, and canned. Kidney, kidney beans. beans, yep. So all of these things can go right into a bowl, steam your beans. So look how pretty those are and cool them in iced water. These the are, ice these water are helps all, them retain their color yes, as it well. Does. Yeah, just kill them in the ice water and then drain them. And mix them all together and you have a fantastic bean salad. Just really delicious. Okay, nice and healthy yeah. for you as well. And don't forget the salt and pepper. And What's this is this is the table. Now wouldn't you like to go to a block party that has all this good stuff? Tacos as corn dogs, the favorite, and these are kind of healthy corn dogs. Are they really? How yeah. can they be healthy? Well, they are. There's, it's cornmeal uh, batter uh, around a really good beef hot dog. Okay. Dip them in, in um, potato what salad. What do you put in your potato salad to make it a little bit different? Well, you can use uh, pickles. You can use sour cream. You can use. I, I always put a little vermouth on the hot potatoes. Really? It soaks it all up. Oh, it's very delicious. All right. You got your yep. watermelon, your fresh berries. You and, made these individual. Yep. Berry oh, pies. The hand I love pies. the way you decorated them. Look at these pies. They're so pretty. All for the 4th of July. Uh, cherry pie, blueberry pie, blackberry pie. A big dollop of whipped cream makes the white. And it goes without saying, you cut the stars out of one pie crust and, and use them on the other, yeah, all right? You're learning. You're Thank learning you. really well. So this is just it. Just a little too, but um, but you can you can do that if you want. But I think this is more fun, don't yeah, you? Yeah, the games are great. It's all can... about gathering people in your neighborhood. Hey, kids, you're standing a little close, you know. <laughs> That's all right. Good results that way. They're getting they're getting high scores. Let's I'll see. I'll challenge you to Look, a game of this they're, after they're, we go got, to commercial they have break. To be experts. Look at this. Everyone's going in. Martha, happy for it. It's been fun to have you see, here this week. Thank we you appreciate so it. Much. And up next, we've got Great American Road Trips. These are must-see places for your family to visit. Coast to coast. But first, this is today on NBC. Thank you.